Comedy Bang Bang, we're back here with Jen Kirkman uh, talking about her book, I Can Barely Take Care of Myself, Tales from a Happy Life Without Kids, and Karen Porter talking about, I don't know what we're talking about with Karen. But uh, it, it's time for one of our favorite features here on the show. It's time for a little something called Would You Rather. Yep, 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 it's time to play Would You Rather, and Jane Kirkman, this is your first time, isn't it? Yes, I love it, I love it, though. All right, and uh, Karen, this is your first time as well, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but yeah. you know how to play, Karen. Oh, yeah. Okay, great. So let me explain it for Jen, though. Uh, I will read a scenario submitted yeah. to us uh, on our Twitter, CBBWIR, Comedy Bang Bang, Would You Rather? And uh, I'll open the floor for questions. You're free to ask me any question about either of the scenarios that you like in order to narrow down your choice. Yes. At a certain point, there will be no warning, but I will close the floor for questions, and then you will be forced to immediately vote. All right? Oh, and I love And then it. we'll, we'll uh, tally up the points. All right, here we go. This comes to us from Kevin Anderson at KB Anderson. Yo. All right. Uh, he asks, would you rather take an annual week-long vacation to an island where you are hunted for sport uh. or always wear skis? Oh, my God. All right. Would you rather take an annual week-long vacation to an island where you are hunted for sport or always wear skis? I've opened the floor for questions. Okay. So on the island where I'm hunted for sport. Jen Kirkman, getting in early with a question. Do I have... Anything to protect myself, like a gun? Do I have a weapon? You are allowed uh, one weapon. You're not allowed guns because you have to fly uh, to the island, but uh, they have a knife store um, right there at the airport when you d uh, okay. disembark the plane. Okay. So they have a knife store. They have, they have a weapon store, but they don't have any guns at this store. So okay. you're, you're allowed enough petty cash to buy one weapon. You can either buy a crossbow or uh, some sort of knife. Um, you know, you can fashion any kind of weapon that you'd like to out of sticks okay. while you're on the island. But uh, one weapon. But uh, the, the the people who are hunting you uh, have unlimited weapons. So, But you're allowed one. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, uh, yes, Karen. Do I get one week paid vacation or – uh, when you go on this vacation, yeah, you mean, or yeah. do you do you want a separate vacation from this vacation? No, do I get a week? Do I get paid for my job when I go to that? Okay, yes. And then do I get paid to do that? You okay? So you want to know? Does your job pay you while you're gone? But you also yeah. want to know if they are paying you while you're on the not right, your right, job right. paying you, but the people on the island are paying yeah, both, you for this. Both, 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 one, two. You're yeah. crossing your fingers like you're hoping to get paid for both. <laughs> Uh, no, unfortunately, uh, your your job pays you for that week off. Okay. okay. But they do not pay you while they're hunting right. you okay. for sport. <laughs> okay. So it's you know, I mean, six of one, half dozen of the other. Right, right, right. I don't right, know right, if that applies necessarily okay, in this okay. situation. But you are getting paid, yes. Okay. So you're paid fifty two weeks of the year. You're working fifty one. Okay. Okay. Right. Gotcha. Okay. gotcha. Yes, gotcha. Jen. Okay. Let's say I'm staying. There, I'm assuming there's a hotel on this island. I'm staying in a resort. <laughs> You're hunted for sport. How are you staying at a resort? I thought maybe that was just like that. Was, there was a safe zone, like the hotel. What room. the? Why, why would you ever leave the hotel? I wouldn't. But then I was going to ask if there's a if there's lawlessness, they could just break down the door and shoot me. So there are safe zones, okay, okay. that you're allowed to spend uh, up to one hour a day at. All right, there's eight safe zones on the island that have supplies. Okay, there. Um, they have uh, medical supplies. They have some rations. Um, you are allowed to spend one hour a day there, but then uh, at a certain point, if you spend more than one hour, you are ejected from the safe zone. And uh, uh, the other thing is, is if you spend too much time in the safe zone, the people who are hunting you uh, can kind of surround that safe zone. Oh, like Pac-Man almost. And the minute you leave, yeah, then, yeah, exactly like Pac-Man. Okay. Yeah. An hour per safe zone or one hour – Divided up 20 minutes at this safe zone, 20 minutes at that safe zone, 10 minutes at that one. Okay, you're already up to 50 minutes, and there's eight safe zones. <laughs> <laughs> um, how much time are you spending at these other safe zones? That's what I want to know. Okay, you are allowed, you're allowed one hour at, in total in all <sighs> safe zones. Yeah. All right. So 23 hours of the day you're hunted. Okay, yes. now— uh, What?! You can sleep in a tree if you like, if you think that uh, that gives you enough cover. No. How many people are hunting us? Great question. Uh, there are there are five families 
allowed to hunt you, okay? And a family is up to five people. Oh, my God. Okay. All right. Much like the five families in The Godfather, and yet these are actual families with a mother, a father. And, you know, I don't I don't want to say it's a mother and a father. It could be a father and a father. It could be a mother and a mother. And- but uh, uh, two people who have consented to share their lives together, you know, in a, in, in a uh, marital way, and their children, adopted or natural. Could I wear children's skis? Okay, we're going to. So that they're smaller. You're not talking about in the hunted. No. You want to wear children's skis, meaning like boots that fit my feet, but then the skis are of a smaller I think You're living size. in a dream world if you think you're going to find children's skis that fit with boots that fit. I'll your have feet. them custom made if I know this is going to be my life. <laughs> you can't get these custom no. made. No, 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 no. Yeah, these uh, these skis are, are uh, made for you. Uh, they are custom made, but they're made to, to fit your feet, and they're regular adult size skis. If I am killed on that island, yeah. Uh, are my killers brought to justice? Yes. Yes. They okay. are brought to justice. This is an illegal operation that's happening. Okay. And okay. Uh, if, uh, your death, if you are killed on this mm-hmm. island, I'm not saying you are, but it triggers a worldwide investigation into these types of uh, island hunting for sports uh, attractions. Okay, good. And then maybe somebody will make a documentary about it. Oh, come on. I, I, no, I think Karen. you guys should see Paradise Lost. No, I'm not going to watch Paradise Lost. Are there Lost. drugs available on the island, like illegal, like morphine, hardcore, like I'm in hospice kind of drugs? Meaning do you you want to buy drugs on the island yeah. from like someone selling drugs? Yeah. There's not like dealers on the island. Is that what you're asking? Anyone, doctors, dealers. You're, where the, I only buy people, the only people on this heavy, island heavy. – are the fa- are the five families who come as tourists so, and the to people come that work hunt at the you. knife store? The people the who work at the yeah, that's a safe zone. They work at the knife store. So there's no and drugs, no opiates. There's nothing. there's not just like a bunch of Rasta dealers hanging out on the beaches. Okay. No, so it's I would just you, be the people so hunting you, and the people who own the island who are like in an underground bunker with uh, cameras everywhere. So if I wanted to bring something, I have to sneak it. You got to sneak it through security. Yeah, exactly. Uh, if I always wear skis, can I live in the Alps? Where do I have to live? Do I have to live in a specific place so that it would be weird for me to wear skis all day? <laughs> you sound really upset about this. You can live in the Alps. Karen, for you, I'll Great. allow it. Great. You can live in the Alps. Great. Jen, you cannot. What about like a – is there like a one hour a day that I can take the skis off? Like there's those safe zones on the island? There are no safe zones in the skis. I'm so sorry. You uh, you have to shower with them. You have to wear them to bed constantly, constantly skis. Sorry, it's got to be a tough choice. You know what I mean? The the hunting for sport, you know, otherwise uh, you would just pick the skis, you know? Is there is there laws about how they can kill you? Like, can they drag it out if they want and torture? Is there torture allowed? Well, the first people to kill you win. Mm-hmm. They win the grand prize. Okay. So they don't want to drag it out. Okay, they that's they want good. to make it a clean, you know, just yeah. they want to behead you like right away. Okay. Yeah. All right. Am I all of a sudden an expert skier or am I terrible at it? <laughs> <laughs> you're terrible at it. You're not good. So, but you're living in the Alps. So uh, I, you chose the Alps. Okay, but I can learn or no, no I'll never have the ability all, no, to learn how to ski You are not properly. an innate skier. Ugh. No. So and you're the one who wanted the Alps. But I don't have to. Let me remind you. You could have picked to? the beach. Yeah, you have to live in the Alps because you you asked about it. Can I get a reality show if I'm on the skis all the time? What would the reality show be? Because she's on skis for life, and it would just be. <laughs> she's on skis for. Is that so, the official title? Yeah, because then I wouldn't have to have a job, and I could just get paid to be on the reality show, and I could kind of have at least a little bit of an easier life. No, you have a job. You ha- there's no reality show. You have a job. You uh, you're doing collections for a bank. <laughs> Wait, why That's, can't I just I can have get my you a normal job. life? I can get you no. a job there. I can't be the you comedian really, on skis. You really think that you're going to be the comedian on skis? <laughs> I think it would be pretty big. <laughs> I don't think so. No, you work in a collection agency. <laughs> can I put wheels on the skis on the bottom? Hmm, I think, think I should this. have the right to do whatever I want. You can only do it if you're in a roller rink. <laughs> because I'm not you know, going to be in a roller rink. Why not? You can put wheels on the bottom of them. If I had a reality show. I could, but I have to be at work now all the time. No, now you point. have to be at work. Karen, look like, it looks like there's something on your mind. Uh, do I get any kind of superpower with either of those scenarios? You do in the island uh, hunting scenario. Okay, and what's that superpower? Uh, you can blow yourself up really big like a big bouncing ball. 
and uh, bounce and bounce around and kind of like if they're if you're in a room with a lot of walls, you can go bing, bing, bang, bang, bing, bing, and just like and you can incapacitate people by bouncing into them. Can like I a, do like that too, or is that just if, for her? That's for both of you. I'll, I'll let both of you do that. Yeah. Wow. This is a tough choice, isn't it? The skis <laughs> yeah. thing is really inconvenient, and you have a shitty job. Meanwhile, on the uh, island, you know, you're paid while you're there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, Jen. You don't have to raise your hand. You oh, can just with jump the skis in. thing. Um, can I have a permanent, like, male model, like, boyfriend that loves sitting on me? Like, he loves... Sitting on he you? He loves... What do you mean? He loves sex in positions that are easy for me. Easy for the skis, in other words. Yeah, and he's not ever going to leave. No, you do have it in the uh, island hunting scenario. <gasps> oh, I do? Yes, you have a, a boyfriend who loves sitting on you. <laughs> well, no, he doesn't <laughs> have to then. Well, I mean, I've... <laughs> If you're into that, yeah, he sits on you uh-huh. and uh, he does whatever you want. And, and that goes for me, too? That goes for you, too, yeah. And, he, and can he be named Scott? <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay. You can be named whatever, whatever you want. Okay, great. Do I get other vacations that year or just I only take one vacation a year? Do I get a non-hunted for sport vacation? You get New Year's Day off. <laughs> okay. If I, uh, okay, if I die, mm-hmm. if in I which, get hunted and which, I die in the hunted, in, one. Okay. In the hunted yeah. Uh, do I have to be reincarnated so I have to do that again the next year? Or do I die and then I'm done? I, I don't have to do it anymore. I'm told, um, um, you know, off scot Well, I guess it depends. Please, you don't have to keep Scott. mentioning my name. <laughs> yeah, it depends on your personal philosophy. So uh-huh. if you believe in reincarnation, maybe you are. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what's out there. All I know is about this island, okay? okay. I, don't, I don't know about what exists after life ends, okay? Okay. I'm not omnipotent. I'm not God, okay? Uh, All I know okay. about is this island where you're hunted for sport. Okay. All right. Do I have to hunt for my own food, or can I just buy, like, a power bar somewhere in the you, safe zone? Yo, you said there's food in the safe zone. There's some rations in the safe zone, yeah, but if you but you're only allowed, you know, one hour a day there, so you have to stock up. And if you lose, you know, if all of a sudden, like, you're rushing through the bushes and uh, there's a big thorn and mm-hmm. ah, your belt, your rations spill out all over, the, then you have to, like, eat the berry. And you don't know if the berries are poison, you know, you know I mean? Uh, how big is the island? It is roughly one city block. What? So it's a little hard to hide from these people. And there are eight safe zones, which most of the island is safe zones. I should have said that. This is, does my boyfriend have a gun, too? He's one of the people hunting no, you that one not. week of the year. Yeah. That's hmm. the irony. He loves you for 51 weeks of the year, but that one week so of the year. So during that one week, I'm not even having sex with him. You on can have island. sex with him, but it's easy but for him to kill you. kill me. Yeah. This really makes a big change for me really because you were leaning towards this i was leaning towards him protecting me and i would just be well you don't have all the information about the skis boning the male model and who cares if i died during it you don't have all the information about the ski scenario maybe you'll tip back the other way i don't know could i take if i took them off would anyone know my skis they are uh surgically attached to your (laughs) feet so the only way to take them off is to cut off your feet okay well there we go but you're not allowed those like Oscar Petraeus kind of, you know, those, uh, those any, legs. any, yeah, you're not allowed so any. I have to stump it. You just stump it, yeah. Um, wheelchair, or actually, you're not even allowed wheelchair. What? Crutches. <laughs> you just got to crutch yourself uh, around. And you have nothing to lean on with your feet, so you have to have really strong forearms. Oh, right, right. Yeah. So you're just swinging. You're just swinging around, yeah. <laughs> so it's not, I mean, then it becomes a, all of a sudden we have a sidebar, would you rather? Would you rather cut off your feet or in the feet. ski scenario or keep the skis on? Do I have a personal chef and a trainer with the ski lifestyle? No. Uh, you do in the ski lifestyle, yeah. yeah you have, oh, you have a personal chef and a trainer. Okay. Although, I don't know why you really need the trainer because, you know, there's no one really going to be that attracted to you because of the skis. Uh, someone, I said, can just come over and sit on me. <laughs> but no one does. Uh, oh, I'm celibate now? I have You're a celibate of- in the ski scenario, oh. yeah. Okay. Would my parents be proud of me in either scenario? No. <laughs> in neither of them? Just you, though. Jen, they're, I'm sure they're proud of <laughs> Man. All right. We're just, a, I mean, we're out of time. By the way, there is not going to be a warning, but the floor will close at a certain point for questions, so you've got to get all your questions out. But there will be no warning about when that's going to happen. Uh, what about in the ski scenario? Is there, like, if a, is there a genie 
if I can find a genie mm-hmm. and get granted a wish, mm-hmm. is that an option? Is what an option? Is there an option? And in this scenario, maybe day seven, someone comes to me and goes, okay, been doing great with the skis. Mm -hmm. There is a genie somewhere in, you know, let's say live in LA. Probably, yeah, but somewhere in the Middle East, let's say. Okay, so there's a genie. That's usually where the genie is. In the world that's willing to grant you a wish. And obviously my wish would be to get out of the skis. So if I find this genie, I can get... And you're able to trick it. Well, I say my wish is to be let out of these skis and he does it. They don't put him back on me, and it's possible I could find this genie. But it's a monkey's paw situation where the genie grants you the wish, says, oh, okay, you want to be out of the skis? Sure. And then all of a sudden you look down at your feet, and you have no feet. Okay. Anymore. Yeah. So, yeah. But, yes, you are allowed that genie to, to get that wish. Hmm. Can I get a reality show on the island? The, your being hunted is a reality show amongst rich people. <laughs> Which is how the word gets out if you're killed. Okay. Is that tape. You know, it's a, it's an amazing snuff film. It gets put on YouTube, and uh, that's what gets all the attention. I know you the said eye. you don't know this, but in mm-hmm. the afterlife, am I conscious of all the fame I have received from the, getting killed on the reality Me, show? So what you're asking is your quest for fame just in your, your own life right now as Jen Kirkman is so important. No, to no, not you important want, to me. You want to know that when you died, you were famous. No, it's not important to me in real life, but in this scenario, I would love to hover over and feel happy and see what nice things people were saying. The one thing I do know about the afterlife is when you die, you are hovering, uh-huh. but only three feet off the ground. <laughs> so you're pretty much at like knee level to everybody. <laughs> That's the one thing I know. By the way, the floor's closed. Oh. <laughs> so sorry, guys. I know you had a million more questions, but the floor is closed. And as I warned you, we're going to have to immediately vote. Jen, what is your vote? I'm taking the island. What? Yes. Really? Yes. Tell me why. I love this hot model. <laughs> of course you do. Um, I just have such faith in myself that I'll get away from them. I think I might even be able to talk them down. Talk them down, really? say we're all on camera here. And you don't want to be seen doing this. It'll ruin your life. And there's major consequences. Mm -hmm. And let's all, like, be friends. I think I can talk them out of it. And I have the the male model. And then I have, uh, I don't care about the food rations. It's Mm -hmm. like a quick diet. And I go back to work. I look great. Mm -hmm. Everyone's jealous. Get a tan. And uh, I still get the model. Get a tan. I love it. (laughs) And I know I could sneak. I would get, like morphine or something and sneak it on the plane and then mm-hmm. I would just be constantly like not in pain in case they killed me it wouldn't hurt okay great all right now Karen how do you like easy Oof. uh I am gonna I, I mean I feel like I have to say the island the island as well <laughs> yeah okay and why is that uh, because, uh, like you said, they'd make a documentary about me <laughs> that rich people would watch it's a show but okay. it's a documentary it's on the internet it's a uh, TV you, show yeah uh, it's real, so it's a documentary. TV show. It's a documentary. TV um, show. I get a week paid from work. TV show. I get a week off. Sure. And have that documentary. TV show. Um, I'd have the boyfriend named Scott. That that seems like a plus. Okay, and even if you're killed, that's worth it to you. Uh, yeah, yeah, because I think I could. Do it. I think I could do it. Do what? What do you mean when you I say think I, I think I could maybe I could make it. it through the week? Maybe. I mean, if I get killed, you know, at least I had a documentary made about me. And, 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 oh my God. And there's Sad. gonna, you know, they're, they're gonna catch my killers and they're gonna bring them to justice. And mm-hmm. then hopefully it's gonna, you know, it's like make you some said, change and impact It's gonna society, make some change. Someone's gonna tell someone else about that documentary. All right. Then. <laughs> God. Let me tally up the points here. And uh, okay, you both voted for the islands, which mm-hmm. makes this a little trickier to uh, judge here. But I will say that the reasons why you voted for the island were very different. Karen, you voted for the island because you thought at least <laughs> you'll have the man, and even if you're killed, named Scott. Named, yeah, okay. But and even if you are killed. You know, at least you had a good life up to that point. Now, Jen, you voted for the island under the assumption that you're able to get away from the killers. Yeah. Let me tell you, you are not. You are killed one hour and one minute in to the very first day. Oh, my God, no. Look, it's one city block. 
How are you going to get away from I'm gonna 20, talk to up them, to 25 people? You're not able to talk to them. There's oh. a massive grand prize on your head. You are you you hang out in one of the safe zones, afraid for your life for an hour, and then you're ejected from the safe zone, and you're <laughs> oh immediately god. immediately decapitated. Oh my god! So unfortunately, okay. unfortunately, Jen, you voted for the wrong reasons. That means Karen, you're our winner. Congratulations! Wow, thanks a lot. Oh my and that god. is, of course, how we play. Would you rather? Thank you. Wow, tight game. I can, wow. You almost had it, Jen. You almost had it, but then you had to try to tr- you had to try to game the system, and that's what I'm trying to do. You know, that's what we're saying here with the documentaries. Don't try to game the system. Yes, you know what I mean? yes. just the way just I live think with your naturally. choices. Watch I can't. Live with I try your choices. to think about ways out all the time. I can't believe no one picked the skis. It's just too much. I can't. I'm not good at it. I wouldn't have the. Sky. You live a long, healthy, happy life. I, but see, I would. I would assume that I would not. I would trip on something and fall. That's why I thought at least <laughs> maybe I could run away. You from think the you're going to trip island. while you're alone in your apartment and fall? You bet I am on those skis. No, you live to be like 85. It's well, you, a short, I didn't it's a, know that. It's a celibate life. I should have It's a lonely asked. life. You yeah, have a no, terrible I, job. No, I can't do that. Well, that's better than dying at uh, five years old. Five years old? Yeah. I'm five when that happens? Well, it starts when you're five. With the, you're hunted starting oh, at age five. Oh, then I don't care five. if I die at five. I have not lived anything to regret yet. But that's it. When you die, that's it. That's the end. I don't know I'm dead, except I'm hovering. You're you're hovering. That sure. sounds fun. I, I, I think it's great. I don't. Know I think I that. gamed the system on this one.